The N-word. The worst word in the English dictionary. And the funny thing is, it is. Because I'm in public all the time. I say many a bad word. And no one bats an eye, honestly. If I drop that word, I probably would get punched in the face by white people. That's a word that no one can touch. You shouldn't go near it. And the NFL is trying to eradicate it. And you know what? I give the NFL a lot of credit. The problem is, like always, the NFL's jumping to conclusions is going ahead of itself and not thinking it out. Because if you thought it out, there's no way this penalty that they're talking about could ever happen. You can't penalize players 15 yards for saying that word when you don't know who the hell is saying it. If you try and give one team a 15-yard penalty for it, how do you know that's the team that said it? You turn around, the ref hears the N-word, oh, flag, well, what if it was the other team? What if it was two guys on the same team? You're going to throw two flags on the same team? On top of that, that word said about 100 times a game, as I've talked to many a former NFL player, and they said, we would have six-hour games if they actually did that. So this new rule is impossible. It'll never get passed. But what could happen is slowly but surely, you remind, you give a list to players of how many times they said it. And each week, the coaches are on them. Listen, you guys got to watch it. You got to watch it. You know, slowly, repetitiously, get them off the word. But this rule is asinine, and it ain't happening. This is the Lube Tube.